That's the update on my dad, my pops. All right, so update on my pops. Yesterday I went to court. Um, he's in good spirits, like I fucking say on my post. But what's going on with the court is that they... I don't want to speak too much because I don't want to get in trouble. But basically, the judges don't want... None of the judges want to take fault for having my father in, in the system, like in jail, in solitary confinement for that long, for no legit reason. So no, nobody wants to get... They're trying to figure a way how they get not get each other in trouble, but dismiss the case of things for one of the charges. So it's interesting, bro. It's it, that courtroom. Y'all lucky we can't have cameras in that shit because y'all will see how fucked up it is. You be like, wow. He because we all spoke. They spoke clear as day what's what's wrong. He knows what's wrong. They see what's wrong. It's been going on for two years, and now they just they don't know what to do. The DEA even show up two hours late to this shit. If they're doing shit like that, they don't have nothing on them. But we will make it happen. We will make it happen. Okay, yeah, for sure, my pops is coming out this year, though. I give it. I give it to guarantee that. I'm about to make some major moves this year for y'all. You see, I don't brag like a lot of these niggas, but you know, my brag is different. I don't know. Why is Daz obsessed with my dad? Because a nigga's a fat bitch. Tell my Daz. And that's what fat bitch ass niggas do. I don't know, bro. That's what niggas like need to do. They need to reach and shit for like that type of shit. Like, you see how he waits. All these dudes talk when my dad locked up. They don't say shit like that when he not locked up. And the niggas is like, I don't get into they beef because these dudes is like 50 years old. The fuck I look like arguing with somebody's grandpa. I'm gonna do beat somebody grandpa up. No, hell no. There, I, I can kill it off right now. I want to know why dad is pissed off, but hell, to each his own, my nigga. <laughs> this is funny. Hey, that just mad because she just his baby mama back in the day. <laughs> hey, bro, why well, you answer your own question, my nigga? There it is there, bro. Like, it's, this shit been going on for years, before even, before before time, bro. It's like the Trojan War. Y'all ever seen the movie Prince of Troy? They started a whole fucking war, war all because the prince was fucking that nigga's bitch, or his wife, in that different state. And he brought her back over to his to his house where he messed up at. Cause you don't bring, you don't be bringing your hoes back to your house, bro. You know what I'm saying? Can't be doing all that, so. Can we doing that type of shit, bro? When we getting the Death Row movie? Shit, bro. When the fuck we getting the Death Row movie? I can't guarantee you that because I don't know. It's just that shit. The wave of that shit is like, I don't know, man. All eyes on me. All eyes on me was a good movie. That was really wet for, for what he like for how he did that. Lt. Yeah, that was, that was really nice to portray because when it comes to those movies, you notice how everybody has something to say about the All Eyes on Me. All Eyes on Me has so many haters. People came out, oh, that was incorrect, that was incorrect, as if, like, Notorious and all the other shit was fucking, like, accurate as fuck. So how LT did it and what, how, what he did, I'm pretty sure he only had, he had a lot more information, but you have to get stuff passed, you know, through people, where people sue the fuck out of you. So he did a good job.